Hello all, welcome to Learn with Kerala MOOCs. Today we are going to discuss how to do a video conference using a new tool, open source tool, which is Big Blue Button. How to integrate Big Blue Button in your Moodle course page and how to conduct a live sessions or live classes using Big Blue Button. Let's go. So let us go uh, open our Moodle website. My Moodle website is teachelectronics.moodlecloud.com and I have opened just open my course page here. And now to add this big blue button, you just need to turn editing on. So just click on the turn editing on button on the gear menu. So the course page will become an editable one so suppose i want to conduct a live course a live session uh, in this first topic so just click on add an activity or resource and here we have uh, in activities we can see the there is a button big blue button is here so big blue button will uh, let you to create uh, some beautiful online live classroom sessions it's an open source web conferencing systems so just double click or click and then click on add button so it will open up the big blue button con configure menu window here so here we can give the name of the classroom so this is live session one so this is live session one and again in the participants list we can give sorry first of all we can give add participants all enrolled users are viewers now if you want to use any participant as moderator so you can select a participant here this is my user is my name and I just add as a participant and my role is changed as a moderator so the teacher become a moderator now the schedule for this session you can set the when will these uh, sessions will open so we can set the time for join session so here I have given this is at 12 38 onwards we can join this live session okay then go down and just click on save and return to course that's all about how to set up a big blue button or a live session in our model classroom it's merely very simple now how to use this live session or a big blue button this is how we can if the student or the teacher wants to join the session you may just click on this live session here so it will open up the big blue button join session so here we have the join session so click on the join session so it will uh, redirect the window into the big blue button server so now let's go yeah it's loading now now first if you want to use both microphone and the headset and you can use microphone and if you want only to listen you don't uh, need to participate in through your mic then you can just click here and if you want to join using your phone you can click here okay that there are three options available so here i am going to start join with microphone so click on here so just click hello then it will do an echo testing here and once you passed this echo testing so if you hear the sound then click on yes okay so i am i joined the in this live session here now uh, what we can do with a big blue button here so here you can see the messages uh, chat messages we can chat here hi and this is the how to we can chat and we can share any notes and here we can see the participants so here i am the moderator i am only the user in this room so some uh, if you want to manage or if you want if you are a moderator then you can mute all the users 
and also there is another option you can mute all the users except the presenter we can assign the moderator can assign any person as a presenter so he can present the his views here now and also moderator can lock all the viewers now here we have again here see here so i'm just clicking here uh, here we have the uh, presentation window is here and uh, this is a, block, a whiteboard and we can use a lot of tools here so here is the number of tools are available in this side and if you want to share with this whiteboard with others or the students then you can use click on this one then it will be a uh, multi user whiteboard is on so if you want to turn off then you just need to click here again and if you if your students want to draw or uh, then you can use these tools here and if you want to write something so we can use here so these are different tools are available here if you want to change the pen tips those tools are available and then again color is here and if you don't want if you want to delete all these things then you can just click on the delete button now how we will share the screen now if you want to share your screen with your students then you can just click on the share your screen here then you can share the entire screen or if you want any application suppose i want to share only uh, these one in excel sheet only then you we can share only this one if you have any powerpoint presentation here then you can share that application merely the, on that application itself we can share with the students and if you want to share any website tab or chrome tab or web browser tabs you can share here so these are the different options available say if i want to share any tab here say uh, i want to sh demonstrate our course page right so i can share with the students here see so see sharing is going on uh, the problem is there yes it's sharing Now, again, if you want to share your webcam, you can just click on this webcam button here. So these are how we can do all these things. Again, there are again, lot of options are available. So here we have a plus button here. The, by using this one, you can start a poll with your students. You may ask a question to your students, whether this answer, if it is useful, whether you, do you think these, uh, big blue button is useful then you can just click on yes yes or no polling so it will uh, take the polling and you can publish the result in the screen itself these are all some of the features again if you if you want don't want to publish the results here okay now if you want to upload any presentation you can click on the upload presentation and just upload the file and confirm the file okay so these are all some of the features that we can use uh, uh big blue button i think uh, since it is an open source one then it is i think i recommend a big blue button to use in your institution and also in your um, moodle course page okay that's all how to use big blue button in your moodle course page thank you all